Hi, I'm Jess, and this little guy is Scruffy from the Wahoo SPCA, and he needs a home, but he is, oh, he's so stinky. So we're gonna give him an extreme puppy makeover. You ready, Scruffy? Let's go! We're going to ensure that Scruffy has a clean bill of health for his new loving family. So he's off to the vet we go! Hey Scruffy, we're here! Come on buddy! Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I'm going to hand you the leash. Okay, while Scruffy's examined, I'm going to wait anxiously for his return. Scruffy, come here, Scruffy. Oh, I know. Good boy. There you go. Yeah. So if you're going to adopt Scruffy, there are some things you do need to know. One of the things that we're looking at is his weight, and he definitely has very minimal coverage across his ribs. My fingers actually go in between each one of his ribs as I run my fingers down his body wall. And then he also doesn't have any excess fat covering his hip bones, which are very prominent back here. Make sure you're weighing him on a weekly basis and make sure he continues to gain weight appropriately. Secondly, he does have a lot of dental tartar, so he will, um, shortly after you adopt him, benefit from getting a dental cleaning done by a veterinary. You see, Kaneohe does do dental cleanings. They come in in the morning and they do stay with us for the entire day, but we do keep them under um, very close watch. So Scruffy does have some external fleas, so he will need a bath to get rid of all of this excess brown debris that we're seeing. And he stinks, so the bath will definitely benefit. Yes, I'm sorry, but you do. We do want to make sure that Scruffy is tested for heartworm and then continued monthly on a heartworm prevention to help keep him internally as healthy as possible. So a lot of these things can sound pretty scary. The main important thing to focus on is that Scruffy is overall very healthy. He has just a few simple things that can be addressed within a short time of adoption and you will live with him for a very long and healthy life. He's got a few minor issues, but otherwise he is in great shape. We just left the vet's office and Scruffy's doing pretty good. In fact, he's turning out to be quite a cute little guy. I think I'm falling for him. This is Scruffy from the Oahu SPCA, and I hear you're good at finding homes. Actually, yeah, we've been pretty successful lately. Uh, we've got quite a few puppies here to, to look at for all our customers, and um, actually we've been working with the Oahu SPCA starting last month, and uh, I've adopted out probably about eight puppies now. Louie is actually from the Oahu SPCA looking for his new home, so we're hoping someone comes in this weekend and maybe takes him. All the proceeds for um, the adoptions here at the Pet Holly go to the Oahu SPCA. Oh, that's fantastic. Well, we're hoping to get Scruffy adopted soon. Okay, well, to help with that, anyone who adopts Scruffy is going to get a uh, free doggy makeover bed and all kinds of uh, shampoos and conditioners and treats and everything. Thank you, Ricky. Okay, thank all you. Right. Thank you so much. Bye. 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 So far, Scruffy has a great bill of health. He just needs a little fattening up. And he's got a wonderful big basket of goodies, courtesy of the pet Holly. And he's the most fun, playful, lucky little poochie. And I seriously think I'm falling in love with this little dog. It's puppy love. Oh, a rose for me. You shouldn't have. with our own picket fence. Wait, what was I thinking? You seriously gotta get a bath. This guy really stinks and he's finally getting a bath courtesy of Tales of Hawaii. Hi, Kylie. Hi, this is Scruffy. Hey, he needs a 
bath. He does stink. <laughs> what he needs is a deep massaging bath, warm bath. Well, obviously, he's not a water dog. So today, he's gone from dirty brown to blue to shiny white. Hey, Kylie, can I smell him now? Yeah. You see how he's progressing? Oh, he's getting so much better. He's skinny, y'all. He's doing so well now with getting a bath. I can't even get my kids to do this. It's time to get him dry. He's like a big white puffer fish. Kyle, what do you think he is? Well, to me, he looks like a chihuahua palm. His face looks like a chihuahua, but his hair is, has a coat like a palm. I've had experience with these type of dogs, and he's scared now, but once he's in a forever home, he'll do just fine, and his anxieties should go away. They're so cute, I have to sneak you into my house. It's time now to get his nails done. So let's see what he will let us do, and we'll pick out what's best for him. Kylie is allowing Scruffy to get used to the Dremel so that she can successfully trim his nails. He's just a little nervous. <laughs> Why are you licking it? That's, no, that's gross. No. <laughs> so yeah, lick lots of these. Wow, he's got a little fetish for this Dremel. Well, we were going to file his nails down with the Dremel. He seems to be liking it a little bit too much, so we're going to have to pass. Dude, not in front of the camera. Ta-da! Oh, you're so fluffy. Oh, and you smell so good. I'm so proud of you, Scruffy. You know what? Love didn't work out for us, but it can for you. Scruffy's still looking for a home, and if you want to adopt him, be sure to check out Oahu SPCA.